We've just met Edwin Brady. Hello, Edwin. Hello. How are you? Fine, thank you. What about your talk? How are you? How are your feelings about your talk? Ah, uh, well, I, I think I got away with it. So, <laughs> so, uh, so I, I hope people, uh, I hope people got something out of it. Yes. You talked about total functional programming. What is it? So, um, a total function is a function where, where, where you know because it type checks that you're going to get a result in finite time. So, so most programming languages, in fact, all mainstream programming languages, when you write a function of a particular type, um, all you know is that if that function terminates, that will be the result you get. So a total function, you know that you're going to get a result of a particular type. So it's, it's uh, what, I, what I'm sort of advocating at the moment is, I'm calling it type-driven development. So you know from the type what a program is going to do. So if you're going to care about types, you really need to care about totality because uh, you know, when you have a total function, you really know from the type that that is the specification and the result of the function is going to be what you expect. So a total function isn't going to crash um, because of an unhandled input and it's always going to get you a result in finite time. No more blue screens of death, basically. Mm -hmm. um, that's what? What about Idris? What are the advantages of using Idris? Uh, so again, it's about uh, type-driven development. It's about being precise about what your program is intended to do. So, so people people often think of types as being, you know, you 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 write your program, you send it to the type checker, and um, and you get told off if you make a mistake. So the type checker says, no, this program is wrong. So Idris um, advocates type-driven development, where you, you give a precise type up front, and then the compiler will lead you towards a correct working uh, program. So the more precision you can give to your types, the more confident you can be, a pro that a pro the more confident you are that your program is going to do the right thing, and the more optimization opportunities you might get. So uh, yeah, it's about correctness and precision. Mm -hmm. And what about white space? How is it nowadays? White space, yes. Uh, I, I haven't worked on Whitespace for quite some time, but I have a feeling that it's going to follow me for the rest of my career. <laughs> um, I have actually implemented Whitespace in Idris, if anyone is interested in, 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 in taking on the project and taking it further and coming up with a, a verified implementation of, of an invisible programming language. So, um, uh, yes, please, please go ahead and, uh, and, 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 and join in. Um, uh, I did Whitespace as a joke, actually, I mean, believe it or not. Um, so I was supposed to be writing up my uh, PhD, and, and one evening I just thought it would be more fun to implement a programming language out of space characters, and it took me about, you know, three hours to hack it up. And I've got, I've got more, than, more than enough entertainment out of it <laughs> over, over the years since. So, um, yeah, go, go and play with it, why not? Thank you for your time and thank you for being so nice. Thank you. Okay, well, thank you for having me. <laughs>